I'm Will Baker, president of the Chesapeake Bay Foundation. Pollution is slowly killing the Chesapeake Bay and its network of rivers. CBF's State of the Bay report finds the bay's health is declining. This is bad for the fish and shellfish we love so much, like the blue crabs. Their numbers continue to decrease. You can hear more specifics on those topics from CBF's Bill Goldsboro and Beth McGee. In 2000, the region's leaders signed an agreement to clean up the bay to make it healthy for fish and humans by 2010. Across the region, broad-based plans of action were developed. They're called tributary strategies, and they draw on the best information science has to offer. Some progress has been made. Virginia and Maryland have made significant investments to reduce pollution from sewage treatment plants. Pennsylvania is offering tax credits to reduce runoff from agriculture. And Maryland passed legislation to reduce urban, suburban, and agricultural runoff in the November special session. However, millions of new residents are moving into the region, making the task all the more difficult. Business as usual will simply not get the job done. So please, urge your governor and elected officials to fight for the Bay. With only three years to go until the 2010 deadline, Bay saving must be cranked up to a whole new level. The Chesapeake Bay is a national treasure that has been neglected and abused. What a terrible legacy to leave to our children. Unless everyone expresses their outrage, the Bay will get worse, not better. We need your help. Check out the State of the Bay report and sign up for CBF's free Action Network.